It is. <laughs> like, yes. Oh, I have the sound turned off. Normally there's like a. Oh, oh, oh okay. Sorry. It, it's been a hot minute. Okay. Or two. We got Wahoo mail. Woohoo! Now, I was a little worried. This is like, seriously. But okay. it held up. Good. Yeah. Good post office mm -hmm. packaging. This is from our friend Patrick Zingcat here on YouTube. We love Patrick. I've talked about him before. I will link his channel below. I will put it in the eye in the sky. Go check him out. He's a great guy. Yeah. Super nice guy. And does a lot of fun videos. So he sent us. Oh my gosh. I a, don't even know. She doesn't know what this is. Oh, now it, I don't know if it opened like that or if it just. It went, it no, just, it was oh, like was that it? before okay. I noticed it. I didn't notice it. I didn't. So he sent this. It does say Kathy and Kim, so I apologize. I did open it, and um, he saw this. This is what I cannot wait to open. It's Sushi Cat. What? It's like a blind bag. He goes, I saw the Sushi Cat and had to get it for Kathy. Then wondered how to fill up the package for both of you. Aww. So he found some taste test things. So this is like a blind bag, and it's like these little sushi, but they're little cats as sushi, which... <laughs> Oh my gosh! So like I haven't opened it because I've never seen. I mean, I love blind bags. Um, oh, Urban Outfitters is this one? Urban, oh wow! We don't have an Urban mm -hmm. Outfitters, do we? So he's crying a diamond. Why oh. am I sushi? So I don't know why he's. Cr That's a diamond. He's crying, mm -hmm. right? Yep. I don't claim to understand, but I want to see what sushi cat we got because there are five. There's five, and I don't know how to say their names. I will. Tr I'm gonna try and like take a picture and insert it, so I can't destroy the packaging. But I thought Kim will be able to identify the type of sushi. Oh, because she eats sushi. Okay, I, I doubt it, but we'll see. As she just did in a recent travel vlog. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's got a. Little, I can't tell. I think it's a little tie. Maybe it's sushi. Oh, a tiger oh, roll. It's a <laughs> no, go ahead. Oh, I was trying to take it, cut it open. Oh, I didn't need to. I just oh, had to just, pull it apart. Open. Oh my gosh! So it's a little kitty cat. Oh my and he's gosh! On, I can tell this is a roll of rice. Oh, and he's a little black. And see, I said it's a tie. You know what he's called? What's his name? It says Shake Boo. Shocky Boo. Shake Boo. Shake Boo. He's so cute. Oh I'm so sorry gosh. that he's not focusing. He's kind of got the grumpy cat face. He looks like he does. Oh WTF? Why am I on yes. sushi? Oh, that is so adorable. <laughs> Patrick, I can say I have never Too seen cute. this. Certainly no. never received it. Did you want to play with it? He's really cute. cute. I'm gonna have to look these up because these are super cute and I love wasabi. And there's one on oh, here. Oh, huh? there's wasabi. He's like rolled in a. He's got seaweed on him or something. Mm. I don't know. Oh my god, this guy, Nayata, has like onions stuck, in <laughs> stuck on him. Stuck on him. Those are so cute. This is oh, super funny. cute. Yeah. Oh, they're hilarious. And all of the faces look like... What? <laughs> really? <laughs> what the sushi <laughs> are you doing to me? It's they like can't really see his face, I know, they're like they? little face expressions. I'll have inserted some photos, <laughs> but it's like... Really? Oh, he's really. so cute. Oh, well, fun. And then, so this, okay, so I find this funny. I showed these to Eddie. He didn't think, I don't know if he thought it was funny. So they're like these chunks of chocolate. Mexican chocolate. Oh. So I'm like, oh, but they're all different flavors. So one's pure, one's coffee, one is guajillo chile. Ooh. And one is cinnamon. Ooh, that chili one is, ooh. <laughs> We're not gonna try them now though, are we? Why did you think I asked you for a knife? I didn't even bring a drink, so. Good. Let's not choke me. So, so what, Pat, or what Patrick said, these chocolates are made locally by a small company in Massachusetts. Very so cool. So I'm like, Mexican chocolate out of Massachusetts. Oh. Yeah, isn't that what we would all think? So I thought it was interesting. So I asked Eddie, I'm like, what am I supposed to do with these? You know, my husband's Mexican. Yeah. And he's like, uh, eat them. And I'm like, well, are they like melting chocolates? Or are we supposed to make um, like right, hot chocolate? Because right. there's um, another one that I get that is specifically, it's like for hot chocolate. So Eddie just told me to eat them. So I'm sure we could do something with them, but for the you know fun of the video and the tasting and the fact that I'm not a chef or 
anything. Interesting. We're just gonna like shave off a little piece, I guess, is the figure okay. best way to figure sure. it out. Yep, that sounds know. good. Okay. Unless you're getting no, I'm any just instructions reading. Here. So it says stone ground. We stone grind cocoa beans into perfectly unrefined, minimally processed chocolate with bold flavor and texture. Okay. So it's a disc. Two discs in there. Okay, so let's I'm we're not doing that one. Why? Okay. Cinnamon, cinnamon, and oh, chocolate cinnamon. Are no, awesome. that was fine. That was fine. <laughs> it's the chilly one. It's not gonna be okay. We've had spicy chocolate. It's not been chocolate. Okay. So where are we spicy. gonna start with? Well, we are back working, so you now assume I got my job. You gotta assume your um sidekick duty and pick the order. Okay, so I just Excuse wanna sniffly. Oh. <laughs> I just wanna start off with the regular chocolate. Oh, sure. Let's start off what what's it supposed to taste like? Right. And I was looking on the back here, it gives a little this is seventy percent dark chocolate. Oh, I wonder if they're all different. And, oh, okay. yeah, yeah they are this different. one's like 55, these are 50. Oh, doesn't matter, but I just thought that was interesting. They're all ne mean. Non-GMO, USDA organic, gluten-free. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, it's kind of already broken up for us. Oh, that <laughs> might have been through the travel, you know, the package. I'm just going to take this little oh, chunk. that works even better if we can just take a little chunk. So they are in, Ooh. it looks almost like, I just want, oh, I can't show it because it's falling apart. Oh. I was gonna, it kind of looks to me like a... Can you grab the bottom one? Nope. That one's oh. broken too. So it is like you could break it. Into like like um, Trivial Pursuit where you oh, like yeah. fill in all your discs. That's not what it is, but... Yeah. I'm gonna break off a piece. So this is 100%. Okay. Dark chocolate. Wait, how do you say chocolate in Spanish? I don't know. Maybe we should have done our research before we did this. Choc right. Chocolate. <laughs> Chocolate. That's how I would say it, and then we'd be like, no, you no, can't just add you an can't e at the end. <laughs> Chocolate. Chocolate. It's the cacao plant. Just eat it. Eat it. It's dark. What's that little crunchy in there? That's just like the beans. Mm-hmm. It is. I like it. I do too. Yeah, it's super dark. I mm. love it. Mm. This one to work. I have a friend that loves dark chocolate. That's really good. You definitely wow. only need a little bit. Yeah. If you're having chocolate craving. That was really good. Don't mind that. Oh, kind of hurt that. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Okay, and Patrick, you need to let us know. If you have purchased these and if you've had them or used them, because he does a whole three ingredient recipe. Oh, yeah, thing. yeah. Yeah. You know, you should. You know, there we go. Let's. We're not really collaborating, but. No, but. <laughs> we're not that organized. <laughs> but if you've done this, I don't. I've never seen you use this, but. Let's try this one next. This what one heck is. What ring are you wearing today? This is my shell ring. That's her new ring. Sorry, I'm distracted. Sorry. Yeah. I'm like. Um, when oh, we were at all... the. Sh Remember at the conch oh, you place? You got the shell. You told me you got a ring. And and I gave my mom one too for her birthday. Isn't it so cute? That is Love pretty it. cool. Yeah. That's what I'm wearing. Okay. I was just like, it was such, I'm like, oh, what's that large? Whoa. She's all like, blingy rings. Okay. Back to this. We're going to do cinnamon. <laughs> okay. Fine. <laughs> we get distracted. Let's see. She says that she was watching our vlog footage where we just like, taping while we were driving and she said I'm worse of a squirrel than she is well duh why do you think you're so bad it's because of me because I just know when I do my videos by myself even without Kim like I'm doing an unboxing and I'm like uh, and I'm like oh wait yeah so let me get back to the real oh there's a whole there's one. a whole one okay okay neither one's broken mm -mm. break out the knife but yeah I was watching this <laughs> vlog footage and I'm like, well, because we were driving and then like a yeah. car would pass. So we'd be having a conversation and Kim would be like, oh, what the heck is he doing? <laughs> <laughs> Am I really? Yes. Sorry. It's okay. It's just like, I'm like, then I'm like, okay, try to get back on track. I, look at that, I took a little bit bigger one. Oh, she took, well, this is cinnamon. I think I will like it. Okay. See, I just use my hands. Oh, I could have probably done that. I got a tea. What did you get? I got a tea too. <gasps> Great teas. minds. We're teas. They're not all teas, are they? No. <laughs> okay. Cinnamony. Cinnamon. I'm still gonna bite it. I put a whole thing in my mouth. 
Did you? I thought she did the, uh, I'm hiding it in my hand. No. Because I'm like, there's nothing in her hand. I don't trust you all the time now. Play one little joke. Mmm. <laughs> I'm getting the cinnamon. Mmm. I think it's good. I wouldn't, I want to eat it for like a snack, but I think it'd be good to cook or something with. Mmm. <laughs> Give me a little heartburn. Ooh. Eddie was asking me how we could add cinnamon in because there's like health benefits from cinnamon. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, I would just add it in my coffee, but he doesn't drink coffee. He doesn't like chocolate. Oh. It's, it's, this it's, would be good in like to melt into a hot chocolate, yeah. I think. Yes, I think so too. Mm-hmm. And it does have palette. that grainy. Mm-hmm. It blends my palate with the cheese it because I didn't bring anything. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Interesting. That was a good one. Okay. Oh man, there's two left and I don't know. <laughs> About either one? Do you get that one? No, out this of one way? I do. Oh. This one will be good. Coffee. <laughs> yep, yep. Mexican coffee. Normally has, I think, chocolate. Have you ever been to Mexico and had like authentic? Mm -mm. Me either. Oh, people talk about it. Let's break off. Woo! I got a Z. I got an A. Okay. Still doesn't, I can't smell it. Yeah, I can smell, I can just smell the chocolate like in the other yeah. one too. All right. Cheers. Cheers. So I put the whole thing in. You took a bite. <laughs> Lesson learned. But I still ate the whole piece. Mmm. This is my thing. But those are like ground espresso beans mm -hmm. in it too. Remember I had those on vacation? Mm -hmm. Very good. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And there are seriously are all of them like three ingredients. This one has cacao beans, cane sugar, and coffee beans. That's it. That's another good one. I wonder if it would melt in my coffee if I make a cup of coffee and just put some in there. Why wouldn't it? I don't know. Because it's me. Mm. <laughs> that was good. These are really good, Patrick. Yeah. Very good. I might not even share them with my work friends. All right, the last one. I'm not happy about some kind of chili doesn't mean that it's spicy not all chilies and peppers are spicy remember we learned the pimento, oh, is, yes, a the pimento is a pepper and that is not spicy and even jalapenos are not usually spicy right they just have flavor so since we do not know what kind of pepper this is or chili we will be optimistic <sighs> I'm just not. There are like so many fun spicy food challenges that I want to do. That, oh, Ponyo! <laughs> that I won't because I know I respect you. Okay, here's a funny story. I just got to add this. So, Kyle's growing up way too fast. He just got a cell phone. And I don't know how we got on the conversation, but he just said something about I embarrassed him one time when we were at McDonald's and he yeah. wanted to order a chicken sandwich. And I'm like, and his best friend was with him, Danny. And he's like, I want the chicken sandwich, Mom. And I'm like, no, honey, that's too spicy for you. <laughs> I mean, there was no laughing, whatever. But apparently, and that was how many years ago, apparently his best friend still gives him a hard time about that. <laughs> oh, Kyle, that's too spicy. Like when they're eating at school lunch. <laughs> Dang it. And it was just like the regular chicken. It wasn't the spicy chicken. No, it was just a regular chicken sandwich. I said, oh, no, honey, that'd be way too spicy for you. God. I'm that mom. You are that mom. And in front of his kid friend. <laughs> well, I didn't think of it. Whatever. They weren't laughing then. But now, yep. He's like, carries that yep. forever. Chickens too. Okay, back to what we're trying. That though. is funny. Sorry. My mom would agree though, because I think I've said that before. She said ketchup was spicy. So oh. <laughs> she didn't like spicy food either. I got the Z. I got the A. A to Z. A to Z. A to Z. I don't know that there's yeah, a I don't song. Either. Okay, let's enjoy this Guadalala something chili. Okay. <laughs> Whole thing. <laughs> it's mostly going to be the chocolate. It does have a different flavor, though. <laughs> it's not a good... Here I'm... comes the heat. Oh, I'm not getting heat yet. I don't like it. I don't like it. <laughs> mm -mm. Definitely has like a chili pepper taste yeah. in there. 
It's not that hot, but it's got a, it's a different flavor. Very I don't think it taste. goes well with the chocolate. It would need to be in something, I yeah. think. And use this one in a recipe. Ooh, there is slowly a little heat coming mm -hmm. way at the end. Mm -hmm. Nice and mild. A little bit yeah. of kick. It's not bad. Thank you, Patrick, for sharing Thinking these. of Kim. Yeah, he's like, I couldn't just send the sushi. They back. were yeah, they were good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it's very good chocolate. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Who knew that, you know, good Mexican food was coming out of Massachusetts. Massachusetts. No, I wouldn't have picked that. I'm sure there's good food everywhere. Yes. But. This is a quick insert because I am so behind on editing that I can do an extra thank you to my friend Patrick, Mr. Zingcat here on YouTube. Um, Kim and I well, I'm inserting this. You're already watching where Kim and I opened a package from him, him and did some taste testing. Well, out of the blue, he sends me another envelope. Thank you, Patrick. I don't even think I've like sent you a message. I need to get my poop in a group. Um, and I just wanted to show you because these are adorable. He sent me some um, stickers. They are, well, they're cats. They're like little file tabs, but I could use them as stickers or anything. You know I will use them. Yes, I will. I could like tag my cat's whiskers with them. Do you think they'd let me? I'm joking, I wouldn't do that to anyone. And then he sent me this, which cracked me up and made me think, um, okay, first, it is just a, a lunch and dinner takeout menu. And you're like, random thing to send somebody, but look, it is a restaurant called Kitties, and it is a um, Siamese cat. Makes me think of my my Lily who passed away. And this is just so cool. <laughs> Kim and I were looking at it, and this is located out in Massachusetts, which I've never been there, but I so want to come and visit you and Peter. And so Kim's looking at this, and I'm like, huh, you know, it looks like some Italian, and there's a lot of things she would have loved, because I'm not a big seafood person, so she's getting all excited, calamari, clams, and I'm thinking jalapeno poppers, <laughs> nachos, spinach pie. Um, anyways, super fun, so <laughs> thank you. And then I thought, I don't... No one needs to send me anything, but if you want to just like send me a note, if you find something random like this that makes you think of me, whether it be cat related or Kathy, there is a Kathy with a C, Kathy's Coffee Shop, and I follow them on Instagram and I can't remember where they're located, but um, I so like someday want to go there. But you know, just send a little <laughs> menu to me and I, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going to start making maybe a smash book with that kind of stuff because I just think it's fun and that way we can connect but thank you Patrick and now back to the official okay. ending of the video well hey that was fun thank you Patrick thank you Patrick we love sushi cat <laughs> oh, 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 oh no he can't be seen yeah no we're not that yeah because he'd be too low heartburn. Uh oh she's getting heartburn I better go find her Thank you again, Patrick. Thank you to all of our friends, new and seasoned. You all matter. You all make our lives better. We love our sushi cat. Sushi cat, sushi cat. See you in the next Bye video, friends. friends. Bye.